Hello, welcome to JD's Prep. In this example, a right cylinder is cut perpendicular to its base. The shape of the cross section is what shape? So because we are, here you have two cylinders that I draw, right? But I'm taking one that is cut perpendicular to its base. So if I take this first shape, here's my base on the bottom. If I want it to be perpendicular, then I want to be um, connecting at a right angle. So I want my cross section to cut perpendicular to the base like that. Okay. And if it's cutting perpendicular to the base, what you'll notice is that it forms a rectangle as your cross section. Versus if you were to cut it parallel to the base. Okay. So let's say if the question asks the right cylinder is cut parallel to the base. Then a parallel cut would be cutting it right horizontally, which would actually get you a circle as your cross section. So if you're talking about a right cylinder, if it's cut perpendicular, right? So that way your cut is perpendicular to your base, you're going to form a rectangle.